So what we have here is we have the Hortolux Platinum Series electronic ballast operating our high pressure sodium and our Hortolux Blue. Yeah. And the reason why we put this display together is to show the main difference between what our ballast does in operation versus our competitors. And if you look close inside the, uh, the glass here, you can see the light beam inside the arc tube. That's called the, the arc stream. And if you look over here, it's a little easier to see. The arc stream inside the Horlux Blue is real straight and stable, all right? And it's not waving. That's a, real, that's a real direct result from the ballast providing a consistent power supply to the lamp to keep the lamp operating as it was designed. What our competitors' ballasts do is they will provide what's called acoustic resonance inside the lamp. And what that is, is that's a waving and a swirling of that arc stream inside the lamp. And that causes color shift, frequent lamp restarts, and eventually lamp failure. This is a straight, stable, consistent light stream. This is a live video of the arc tube operating. And we're doing this to show you the difference between the two different ballasts and how they operate. Now this is gonna go and it'll switch over. Okay, what you're seeing now, this is our 1,000-watt uh, Hortolux Blue operating on our competitor's electronic ballast, and this is acoustic resonance. So what you're seeing, this is the swirling and waving inside the arc tube. This is a direct result of inconsistent power being supplied from our uh, competitor's electronic ballast. This is what will cause color shift, frequent lamp restarts, and ultimately lamp failure. And what you're seeing here now is a side-by-side -side view of our ballast on the left operating our 1,000-watt blue and our, competitor, uh, our competitor's ballast operating the 1,000-watt blue as well. And you can see a, a very big distinct difference between the two arc tubes and their performance. That's all a result of power being supplied from the ballast. Now, being the fact that it doesn't have the high hertz level that some of the other ballasts have, are you guys able to run some delicate bulbs like, um, you know, just say a gardener had bought a Hortolux, Lux, but his friend had given him, let's say, a Sun Pulse, like a whole start bulb. It's, you know, they're pretty delicate. Would, you, do you, would, it, would it be a, a, a good pair with your ballast? That's a great question, and yes, this ballast can run any lamp type, uh, or I'm sorry, any lamp brand, because the, the ballast runs all lamps, to their ANSI specifications. And that's extremely important when it comes to what our ballast does and what other ballasts do not do. Our ballast is specifically designed to operate lamps to their ANSI specifications. All lamp brands, it doesn't matter whose lamp it is, are all made to same ANSI specifications. And with that being said, the ballast has to be able to provide a consistent power supply to the lamp to, prov to provide the light. Okay, what we have here is we have a uh, view inside the ballast, and the reason why we show this is so we can show everybody our patent pending cooling technology. And if you look close in here, where you see the holes, that's called the heat sink plate. And what we do is we actually draw the air in from the back side of the ballast, and it runs underneath the heat sink plate. And we do that for a couple reasons. We pull the heat down away from the, away from the electrical components. It keeps dirt, dust, and moisture away from those critical electrical components. And then it is expelled out through our fan. Another uh, really important part of the ballast is these two things here. They're called the thermal couplings. The thermal couplings consistently measure the temperature of the ballast. If the ballast were to ever overheat, those thermal couplings would shut down the ballast as a precautionary measure to protect your ballast, your lamp, and your hood. Yes, it's a 120, 240 volt. Um, it's, there's no dimming on it, it's a straight ballast, so you, you basically you turn the ballast on, it does have an on-off switch. It is ETL listed. It comes with a full five-year warranty, not a prorated warranty. It comes pre-packaged with a, a Super HPS 1000 watt lamp for free inside the box. It is important to know that the Hortolux Blue Metal Halide Lamp 
is a, a lamp that you can take from start to finish and have that as a one light source lamp. Because the spectrum so closely mimics the spectral distribution of the sun, you can use that from start to finish. Thank you.